Welcome back to Bifocals. We've been looking at the development of clubs here in Laguna Woods and at the upcoming Village Games. Uh, the first ever senior event of archery will be at Griffin Fitness Center, so we're going to hear from that representative now. Hi, I'm uh, Coach Corey Price here at Griffin Fencing Center. We're here uh, with the Laguna Woods um, community. They're doing a little bit of archery. We've been here uh, doing archery for about uh, one to two years, maybe one and a half or so. And uh, uh, I personally just started learning this sport uh, when we opened it up about a year ago, like I said. Um, Coach Eric, who is the owner operator, he's been doing it for 20 years or so. And uh, he started doing archery uh, because he was a fencing coach for so long, wanted to uh, try out uh, you know, a different sport, something a little bit different. He actually really liked it. Uh, I'm in the same boat. I was a fencing coach for a long time, and now I've started doing archery, and I found out it's, a, it's got a really nice, easy learning curve, so I was able to become uh, fairly good at it, fairly confidently, pretty quickly, and that was exciting for me, so I stepped with it. Um, How did you get involved with these guys? We're putting on the event here, right? Yeah, I, I got involved with these guys. Um, somebody approached us uh, about doing a, a little event here, and since we uh, just kind of started our archery, we decided we would host you guys for sure, and um, it's been a great event so far. I've enjoyed talking to everybody and all the people here. Okay, so in the year that you've been doing this, uh, have there been any accidents? Oh, we haven't had any accidents so far, none at all. In fact, it's been pretty nice. It's Why do a, you think that is? It's a really safe sport. I mean, it, it, sure, it's a, you're trying to shoot a target, and it's a, it's a weapon, um, but you're not on the other side of the weapon. <laughs> so uh, it's actually really safe. You don't get hurt. You, I mean, it, Nothing really ever happens. It's pretty nice. Extremely safe. And what about seniors? How do they do here? Uh, seniors do really well. Um, the, the bow doesn't require too much strength to pull back, and, and, and it's very adjustable. Uh, so we, we've had no problems. I, have, I teach five-year-olds all the way up to, you know, as far as, far as you want to go. It's, it's pretty nice. Let's hear from one of the brand new members of the club. I'm Cupid Velasquez. You are a Laguna Woods resident? Yes, I am. I've been here since July. And uh, when was your first time coming I, to the Laguna Woods Archery Club? Today. <laughs> <laughs> today was my first day. And how, have you ever shot before? Yes, I did when I was 17. That's so, a long time a ago. A few years ago? Yes, a few. <laughs> okay. And uh, what do you think about this uh, upcoming event? Oh, this is exciting. I think this is real fun. Since my name is Cupid, I thought I, I need to find a sport that I would like to do, and I'm not very good at tennis or anything like that, so I thought this is perfect archery for Cupid. Why not? <laughs> Hi, my name is Betsy Inger, and I found out about the archery club through reading the Globe, and I had been in archery since about 1958 as a student, and then a competitor, and then a teacher and coach for all these many years, and I decided I would like to help them organize the club. So that's how I got involved. And now that we're going to be in the Village Games, uh, it's going to be quite an event and a learning experience for a lot of people who have never been competitive. And we hope it's a real fun event. And I uh, will run it as though it was in the uh, Olympic Games. So uh, tell me, um, do you have to be an expert to participate in this event? Absolutely not. Uh, it doesn't take very long to, to learn how to shoot arrows. That was one reason why it was so fun for me to teach it for so many years. Uh, within a couple of lessons, the people are quite competent, and they can shoot right next to the world champion, uh, which is no problem at all. And it's a, it's a safe sport, and uh, what about for seniors? No problem at all. Uh, in fact, we're all going to be those in the games. <laughs> you know, some of the popularity of uh, archery, which is booming right now, is because of the Hunger Games. And I did see the most recent Hunger Games catching fire, so I think we should take a quick look at that clip. So, what are your favorite archery characters? Ah, that's a thin area. It's got to be Robin Hood. There's a great Robin Hood with Errol Flynn. I think we could take a quick look at that trailer.
England, in the gallant days when history hung on the flight of an arrow or the slash of a sword, when feudal barons ravaged the countryside to live in pomp and splendor, when one man alone dared challenge the might of his country's oppressors, Robin Hood, outlaw of Sherwood Forest and his stalwart band, robbing the rich to feed the poor, ready to fight for king, for country, or for maiden fair. Now this forest is wide. Can shelter and clothe and feed a band of good determined men, good swordsmen, good archers, good fighters. Are you with me? It's Errol Flynn as Robin Hood, Olivia de Havilland as Maid Marion, Claude Rains, Basil Rathbone, and the cast of thousands, reliving history's most colorful adventure. I suppose you realize the penalty for killing a king's deer is death. Are there no exceptions? Will you come with me? Sure, I have nothing to offer you, a life of hardship and danger, but we'd be together. Because I love you, Robin, I'd come. Even the danger would mean nothing if you were with me. Let me ram those words down his throat, Your Highness. From this night on, I use every means in my power to fight you. You know, another Robin Hood was Russell Crowe in the past. Mm -hmm. Did a pretty good job of it, I think. We saw that one. Uh, but you know, speaking of Russell Crowe, I think we should take a look at the most recent Russell oh, Crowe film. Oh, Noah, yes. Noah. Noah. Let's take a look. Well, we have to see that movie. And remember, our full reviews are on L&L &L Magazine. And uh, so, I guess we're done for this segment. and. Until next time, here's, here's looking, looking at, at you. you.